hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in case you're new here hi my name is betty money and you are in the right place so in today's video as you can read from the title today we are doing a bedroom makeover it's not as a uh, huge makeover as you think but it's something which i'm so sure you can get a tip from it so this is the before of my bedroom area so those were the curtains i was using i didn't have a curtain rod because the houses don't provide curtain rods and those are the curtains i have uh I don't think this the wall papers are going to change i'm not going to paint the walls anytime soon but i will have to uh that is the pillow those are the pillowcases i have for the meantime and that is the mattress i was using and at that corner it's where i used to place my oils and everything and my ring light which has actually occupied a lot of space so the first thing is i actually have to move everything and clean up and yeah so i moved the car table and i had to clean up uh where it was because before you actually have to start everything make sure your space is clean so that's the first thing i am going to do and now if you have been following me or watching my videos you you know that i had purchased this mirror and it was in my living room so i had to move it to the bedroom because i thought this was the best spot or position for it so i moved the mirror to the bedroom area and i okay you'll see in the in the next clips i loved uh how it actually looked but it actually uh did disturb me with where to place it because there is an angle which i actually wanted it to be then i also moved my shoe to the bedroom because where it was was not actually the right position for okay according to me to place the shoe so the bedroom side was a good position to place it so i think okay i had in mind of i had in mind where to put the shoe and the the mirror but unfortunately it turned out that it was a bit small the space was a bit small so i had to play around with uh everything and later on came up with where to place it so i'm now figuring out where to actually place the mirror which actually re did disturb me honestly uh because what i had planned actually did not work out so it was up to me to make up my mind so fast and decide where to place the mirror so in case you're wondering pinterest has been my help for the longest time and okay let me say uh some youtube videos i watch youtube videos actually but pinterest has contributed a, a lot a lot in this makeover because i don't know if you don't have pinterest and you love good houses you love dressing up you love fashion i don't know what you're doing actually so i i'm still changing the mirror the position of the mirror i had to remove the frame because i have in mind uh spray painting it which i actually did so i bought a white spray paint which i spray painted on the wall but it it actually uh spread i used i covered it yes but it is spread and i had to remove it So after I had done spray painting, obviously I, in in uh, the bedroom cover, sing a kind of your string, Uzi. Let me just call it Uzi. If you don't know, it's the string I used to attach to hold my curtains, which didn't look that pleasing. So I bought a uh, curtain rods, which was 1.5 meters. Uh, it was going for like a thousand bob. Uh, which was fair to me. I don't know. Maybe it was a bit expensive to you, but to me it was fair. So I got curtain rod. Which uh, another thing is curtain rod really really change uh, the look of your rooms. And in this, I really needed help uh, because I could not do it alone. So we had to first measure the to drape on your curtains. I went with the same same curtains which were which were on the on the which were on the on the on the on the window before so we had to measure and he had to help me with 
putting it on I think excuse my window it's not that clean but I ended up cleaning it uh, since they actually built the houses they no one has ever bothered to clean the window so I think I'll do it So guys as you can see you can actually see the mirror is not that clean so if you ever use a uh, spray paint na is spread kwa either kio ama any glass use acetone is it acetone or acetone i don't know but what i mean is use nail polish remover which has acetone i had to google uh ni tafute kitu ya kutoa the spray paint so i used nail polish clean the mirror and it worked magically magically not magically So finally the curtains were up but another thing is the next morning i was like i need to change these curtains i saw something on pinterest and i was like i really really need to change the curtains and i changed the curtains to uh they are, they are curtains yes but they look like shears which actually looked so so good then it's now turn to make the bed one thing is i bought another mattress mm -hmm, is as you can see it's not the same mattress i i was using it's a different mattress so it was my turn to use uh to now make the bed so i used the same same bed sheets i had before so i didn't have to purchase uh new bed sheets but i had planned to purchase new bed sheets which i'll probably do uh after some time but i think for now i have enough bed sheets but I love white bed sheets and not all of the bed sheets are white so I think I'll replace the bed sheets I have which are not white with plain white bed sheets. The same thing applied to my uh, my pillows. I had enough pillows, so I didn't think it was good to purchase other pillows. But I'll have to purchase them. But first of all, you don't. Uh, some. I let me give you a cut tip. Uh, don't purchase something just because you have seen it. That is me in 2022. Just think about it first. Then think whether you think about whether you actually need it that much so then you now purchase it if you actually need it so i didn't see the need of me purchasing other pillows but i wanted them but i still have others so let me just use what i have for now Dio in nikinua a queen is it a queen or a king said bed i'll buy everything new but let's work with what we have for now and save some cash so now it was my turn to yeah my turn to actually put the duvet cover uh, I have a grey duvet so I thought it was good rather than buying rather than buying a white duvet so I thought it was good to just get a white duvet cover which works magically so I'm now putting the duvet cover 
in the what hata niwaambie kitu kingine duvet cover really really helps it helps you with you don't have to keep on washing your duvet each and every time you just remove your duvet cover wash your duvet cover ni unarudisha that is the best part of a duvet cover so if you have a duvet just buy a duvet cover it will really really save a lot everything is coming together and i love i already love how my bed looks from mimi ndio najua vile hiki tande ilikuwa inakaa so on the, when it comes to pillow arrangement uh, it's up to you wewe panga vile unataka but according to pinterest this is now how you're supposed to arrange your pillows not the other way zikiwa zimesimama but you can do it as you can do it but like unaona kitanda yako inakapo so another thing i have to tell you is uh the green capillo i used green because the throw blanket was green a good quality throw blanket from ikea as you can see and i really really loved it it's so huge it's like another duvet actually and i loved it i loved the color it looked so so good that's why i used the green uh throw pillow so now this is the before of how everything was the 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 the, the corner where actually we had the castan the curtains where we actually didn't have curtain rods i didn't change the frames but i had a plan to change uh i changed the mattress changed the pillow cases i didn't change and this is the after I, uh, another thing i have to tell you is uh i had to put the mirror on top of a castle i had bought uh the the cut i know it's the a chapati stool but you can add, you cannot know it's a chapati stool i had bought it for for as a side table a bedside table but it didn't work as a side te- bedside table because the space is small so i used it to place the, the mirror the mirror it reflect vizuri so i love how the curtains turned out the shurak i earring light i'll have to remove it from there that's me and the, the two holes i'll have to paint this house some day so what i'm talking about is this castool i had placed the mirror and a pampas grass i don't know whether it's a pampas grass or any grass to a manini but i had thought about putting a plant but the green could be too much so i got the grass which turned out looking so good because this is my best spot so far the bedroom area it's my best spot i love the throw blanket i really love it i got it from budget wear it's a thrift store ni kama think twice somehow it it it, it was an offer but kumbuki nilipata na pesa ngapi but it was an offer i really, really love how this looks and i'm so proud of where i have come from in, in when it comes to ku arrange nyumba 